okay this is a behind the scenes video to, on how to publish an audiobook to ACX and find a way voices okay to publish to 40 plus audiobook stores out there including Amazon audible iTunes and 40 additional platforms uh, through find a way voices like Google and Bibliotheca and so forth okay so um, this is one example how expert guide to Pittsburgh Pennsylvania under one tips to learn the history discover the best places to visit eat great food and have fun exploring Pittsburgh Pennsylvania by how expert with Nathan Ion. Okay, so um, I'm gonna. What I like to do is I don't listen to the whole audiobook for time purposes, but I do listen to the first 10 to 15 seconds to make sure it's the correct file for all the files. So let's do that right now. Okay, behind the scenes. Okay, it's three hour audios. This is what I want. I want each audiobook, by the way, one quick tip here is to make at least three hour audiobook because on Amazon, once it becomes over three hours, the price of the audiobook changes from what I believe $6.95 to $6.99 to. Fourteen ninety five to forty nine nine nine. Okay, fourteen ninety five, I believe. So that's why we make the word count of the book around thirty thousand words. Okay, some narrators finish around thirty thousand, uh, three hours. Some people a little bit more. Some people a little bit less. If that's less, I just go with it. Okay, unless they can really make it, you know, three hours. But uh, anyhow, uh, let's get for let's listen. Open credits. Discover the best places to visit eat great food, and have fun exploring Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Written by How Expert Nathan Ion. Narrated by Robert Taylor. Okay. Chapter 1. Begin your visit. There are... Chapter 2. Get around the city. There are... Chapter 3. Places to visit in the city. There are literally... Chapter 4, Places to Eat. Eating in the city while... By the way, you want to do this because... Finding recurring things to do in Pittsburgh. Sometimes, once in a while, I have found the audio file was a wrong file from a different book at one time. So, you want to double check all the time it's the correct file for each of the files and chapters. There are things to do in Pittsburgh all the... Chapter 6, Finding Fun in the City. If you, chapter 7. Travel Packages. Chapter 8. Best Emergency Medical Care in Pittsburgh. This has been How Expert Guide to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. 101 Tips to Learn the History. Discover the best places to visit, eat great food, and have fun exploring Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Written by How Expert Nathan Ion. Narrated by Robert Taylor. Copyright 2022 by How Expert. Production copyright by How Expert. Chapter 1. Begin your visit. There are always things you should do before you decide to take a trip anywhere. Okay, Obviously, everything sounds good to go. So what I'm going to do is click on approve, which I did. And then I, I, and then I, I, I sent the money. I sent a message using this send message producer to and I sent the message saying, hey, send me a PayPal money request. Instead of me asking for their PayPal uh, email, which takes more steps, I just said, hey, just send me a money request to me, you know, then we skip the step of asking for them and then I got to find it. I got a message, you know, it skips one step. So it's faster actually sending, asking them for a money request, which 99% of them do. Okay. And I understand um, the 1% sometimes they may say, hey, this is my PayPal. If that's the case, I just send them afterwards just to make, okay? But uh, send a money request for this amount, and the amount is going to be shown here. It's a fixed a one-time payment. That's the option I choose. Instead of sharing royalty, I just do a one-time payment, which I recommend everyone to do. So 174 And once that's paid, I'm going to click on the Yes button here. Send payment to producer. Yes. And once I click on this button, there's going to be a button on the narrator's end on their dashboard on ACX that says, hey, did you get payment received? They got to click on that button as well. So I'm going to pay now as I pause this video. I'm going to pay. I'm going to come back. OK, one second. I'll be back. Thank you. So I just sent the payment via the method that most of the narrators and I use, which 99 percent is PayPal. 
So I just paid right now, okay? So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to ACX under uh, produce audio book and the fifth step, send payment to producer. I'm gonna click yes, okay? So the payment has been paid. It's a third party. You don't pay through ACX. You gotta make a message and an agreement. Hey, let's pay, can we send a money request for PayPal. Like one per one time, uh, one narrator didn't have a PayPal. So I use Zelle or whatever. But uh, in the future, they have PayPal. So I don't know. I'm, I'm, as of right now, it's PayPal. I'm sure there's other methods if you have to use you know, the route, okay? Um, after, okay, so I send the pay, uh, payment to via uh, PayPal for ACX. So everything's done on my end, okay? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the next. Now, now ACX is going to check it. And they're going to, uh, once they approve, it goes to Amazon Audio Audible and to iTunes, Apple iTunes. Those are the three. But I chose non-exclusive option. So now, since I paid, technically now already, by PayPal, another platform, like I could publish it anywhere I want. So I'm going to publish it to Find Away Voices, which as of right now is, I would consider it the second most uh, popular and, and powerful uh, audiobook platform out there because it publishes to additional platforms outside of Amazon, Audible, and Apple iTunes. Okay, which ACX is great for, I, which I recommend to use two multiple platforms just to be, you know, just to have uh, not all your eggs in one basket. I recommend a wide approach. OK, so now what I would do with a, a find a way voices next step is I'm going to show you the details. I already set up all the details here, but I'm going to show you quickly from start to finish. OK, first of all, I uploaded the cover, which looks fantastic. Shout out to our designer, okay, Howard Expert Guide to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. It's a city travel guide that shares 101 tips to learn the history, discover the best places to visit, eat great food, and have fun exploring Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Okay, title, subtitle is filled out. Basically, anything that has an asterisk, you, I recommend you to fill out. And if it doesn't have it, you don't have to fill it out to submit it, but if you want to, you can. Description, I just put a basic description here. Okay, and about the author section at the end. And publisher, uh, my brand name, author names, uh, narrator name, abridgment, uh, unabridged, or the other option is abridged, but unabridged is the full version, so I choose unabridged version, language English for me, for this particular book. Uh, keywords uh, separated by uh, some keywords, um, just basic keywords, not that much, about 5 to 10. Uh, then classification, nonfiction, age 18 plus, uh, because uh, it's not for kids particularly, okay? Uh, primary BS BI uh, category is travel. I could put an additional um, keyword um, or category. So let me see if there's another category for this particular uh, topic. Um, travel. Let's just do U.S. somewhere. General in U.S. maybe. That's not the West Coast. Hold on, man. Hold on a second. Let me just do general, okay? All right. Audiobook retail uh, ISBN. I got it from my, myidentifier.com, which is uh, associated with Bowker, the official place to get ISBN. So I put the audiobook. So it can be the same for retail and library on Find A Way Voices. I read, I read, read the frequently asked questions. They answer that. It could be the same. Uh, important dates. Uh, I'm going to put the current date. Okay. Whatever its current date is. Uh, copyright is the current year. Uh, copyright owner, I put my publishing brand name. Uh, copyright year, same year. Copyright owner, same thing, audio. And price wise, I put $19.99. To be honest with you, it's a three hour audio book. But for library price, it could be two to three times higher than the retail price, generally speaking. So I put $49.99. That's what I do. Okay. Um, save changes. And by the way, just because you put this as this price doesn't mean I think on all platforms it goes this price. But this is just why I do it for simplicity purposes. I could put it exactly like Amazon, maybe like fourteen ninety five or ninety, yeah. And but I just do it like this for right now. Okay, save changes, everything saved. Next step is I go to the distribution section. In the distribution section, I choose Voices Plus instead of regular Voices. Voices Plus reaches out to more stores. Okay, but the only caveat is like six months you can't make changes or whatever but i really don't mind okay and so so view the detail list to edit so everything's checked except the only two things i don't check is obviously apple and audible and amazon okay those two check boxes because i don't want duplicate content 
and I, by the way I publish to Apple Audible Amazon using ACX on another platform so I don't want you know complications so I want to work with both platforms so that's how I do it going wide and then next yeah, I don't have to update everything's the same, same I go to audio section in the audio section I have the opening credits I have the chapters from one to the final chapter I've got, I got the ending credits retail sample which are the required ones having an asterisk okay just like ACX the audio farms are very similar as you can see from opening credits chapters content retail sample and uh, closing credits those are the main ones opening credits main content uh, uh, closing credits they call it ending credits retail sample after that click review chapter names just review real quick and by the way you can edit the chapter names once it's uploaded okay and you can move it up and down and so forth and everything's good confirm um, lastly I'm just gonna click on review and submit at the top right corner okay, and it's gonna ask you for the price one more time I believe um, let me let me exit out let me do this again okay review is submit okay click submit for publishing let me do it again one more time okay submit for publishing okay so everything's good there you go one real life example how to publish an audiobook to ACX and find a way voices to reach out to Amazon audible iTunes and 40 additional audiobook platforms out there thanks for watching I gotta go I'll talk to you soon take care click the link below the video to check out my recommended resources about publishing book publishing self-publishing and more thanks for watching talk soon take care bye